This shooting highlights a growing and troubling trend at Oakland's Highland Hospital. That's where three of the victims are being treated. We want to show you a graph, and according to the data from the Alameda Health System, the trauma team of experts treated 23 gunshot wounds per month in 2018. But look now, in 2021, that number doubled, leaping to 46 per month. In addition, in 2018, the Alameda Health System treated 278 victims. In 2021, 547 victims. Crown Forest Teresa Sassio talked to the hospital CEO about these growing numbers. The explosion of gunfire steps away from classrooms at East Oakland's King Estates campus sent three of the most seriously injured victims to Highland Hospital. Now, as patients, they become part of a disturbing trend, a skyrocketing number of people being treated for gunshot wounds. You know, we were seeing in 2018, we were seeing <clears throat> 23 gunshot wounds a month, 2019, 24, so very similar. There was a spike. It jumped in 2020 to 40 a month. 2021, we saw 46 a month. And this year, we're on a pace to see 44 a month for the year. So, you know, really, when we say a doubling, it's not an exaggeration. James Jackson is the CEO of Alameda Health System, which has 760 physicians on nine facilities. Highland Hospital is the system's highest ranked trauma center. In 2018, we saw 278 gunshot wounds, um, 2019, 283, so again, very comparable, and then the spike. In 2020, we saw 478, and uh, 2021, 547, and we're on a pace to see similar numbers in 2022. Jackson says what the numbers don't show is the emotional and physical fallout of gunshot wounds. He says recovery can be very complicated. We obviously, our business is helping people when they are in need and when they have these sorts of injuries, but I think we can do more. Um, to see the Wilmachan Highland Hospital, the Alameda Health System as a place where you go and you're shot, I think is a woeful understatement of who we are and what we do for this community. And I'm very interested in doing the work to try to prevent these sorts of injuries, these sorts of harms to the extent possible. Jackson adds that he hopes by bringing awareness to this issue, it could make a difference and change the direction of the harsh reality of gun violence. Teresa Estacio, Crown 4 News.